You know, whether you run marathons, play basketball, or take an occasional walk through the park, the pain from heel spurs can be excruciating. Well, now a new FDA-approved treatment is bringing relief to many of the two and a half million patients in pain. Mary Messmore plays with her dog while sitting down. She can't ski, hike, or play tennis either, all because of heel pain. I was playing tennis. Uh, we were on vacation, and it felt like a pop in my foot. And since I'd had it on my left foot, I knew exactly what had happened and have been limping ever since. Mary injured the plantar fascia, a rubbery tendon that stabilizes the foot during activity. Herbert Hollage sustained a similar injury playing lacrosse. The best way to describe it's like a nail running up into your foot, you know, or something pushing real sharp pain up in the center of the bottom of my heel. And uh, I said, well, I better see the foot doctor. When conservative treatments don't work, some patients are turning to the same shockwave therapy that's been breaking up kidney stones for decades. Dornier was the inventor of shockwave therapy. They discovered it as an aircraft company trying to find out why they were getting pitting on the leading edges of supersonic aircraft through rain clouds. And when they discovered that there was a shockwave that was actually disintegrating hard substances, they found a way to administer that to the medical field. Today, Herbert is getting the treatment. He hopes he's one of the 91% who are cured after one year. It preserves the plantar fascia, so mechanically the foot's intact. Um, the risks are, are minimal. Um, the patient can, put, can go back to wearing their normal shoes and return to activity the next day. The ward's gotten around, and I have a lot of patients that are excited. Uh, of course, this doesn't preclude the tr conservative treatment. I mean, we have to go conservatively with the stretching and the icing and, and orthotics. And then if that doesn't work, we have another tool available to, uh, you know, attack this uh, nasty heel pain. Now, a few steps you can take to avoid heel pain. Wear shoes that fit well, have good shock absorbent soles, and a supportive arch.